All right, Hannah, thanks so much for that. <laughs> it looks beautiful to me, but everybody else is saying it, it doesn't. Today's storm has a lot of Western New Yorkers on high alert. Nobody taking any chances knowing just how destructive Mother Nature's fury can be. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ed Riley is continuing our team coverage tonight. He is live at Canal Side tonight. Well, here in Western New York, it's day number two for high winds. Yesterday, we saw winds in Dunkirk clocked at 62 miles per hour. Today, those winds blew into the Buffalo area, causing power outages and damage. And you can see some of that damage right over my shoulder here at Canal Side. But you know, even in the middle of this storm, we found some people who are so completely fascinated by Mother Nature's fury that they're willing to put themselves right out in the middle of it. Uh, it is really cold, like I'm freezing and I got a leather jacket on. <laughs> what do you think of this wind? Uh, it's not this is what it looked like along the Lake Erie shores around Buffalo. Strong winds whipping up the water and creating gigantic waves that came crashing over the break wall near LaSalle Park in Buffalo. But even as the weather fury continued, there was a large number of people who came to the waterfront to see for themselves what was happening. I just love watching the water every time I come down here. Summer, winter, any weather, thunderstorms. It's always beautiful to look out and see the waves. There was just as many people in Hamburg who came out, only most stayed in their cars. Ooh, me scary. One area that was watching the water with apprehension was Hoover Beach in Hamburg. This area has been flooded before during high wind events, and today the waves were splashing on homes and tossing debris at windows. I woke up to a house shaking all morning long and stuff, and then look out, and then all the waves are hitting, hitting the windows, and, and how how far the, the water comes over the wall. It's amazing. I've never seen it like that before. When the winds blow this strong, they push a large amount of water towards the Buffalo end of Lake Erie. Those rising waters destroyed a special event planned for this weekend at Canal Side called Canal Oween. Instead of scary attractions and paintball activities, all that's left now is $7,000 worth of damage. Yeah, we had we had a big event on Halloween too. We had like 80 kids, a couple birthday parties coming down with down here, a uh, hockey team from Pennsylvania doing the paintballing, so we lost uh, lost out this weekend for sure. Now, organizers of Canal Halloween tell us the shame of this is that there was a big hockey tournament coming to Harbor Center for this weekend, and they were really looking forward to coming over here for the Canal Halloween event. Now, Canal Halloween is canceled for this year. They hope to come back next year, but they're not going to set up in this location because of Mother Nature. And as you can see right now, we're getting hit with some hail coming down right here in downtown Buffalo. Live at Canal Side, Ed Riley 7, Eyewitness News. We'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, Ed, you and Hannah need to drive. Off now. Neighbors from all